traditional musical instruments to weapons, to customs and traditions. This is a quest into the cultures and traditions of the beautiful tribes of Kenya. This is Culture Quest Documentary Series. What does Mount Kenya, a bird and a tree, have to do with the creation story of the Agikoyo tribe? In this episode, we explore the story of the Gekoyo tribe, their beliefs, rituals, customs, and songs that define the Gekoyo people. This is Culture Quest, the Agekoyo documentary. The Agekoyo tribe, commonly referred to as the Kikuyus in Kenya, are a Bantu-speaking community that is mostly known to be farmers. The Gekoyo creation story starts in Mount Kenya, where the first Gekoyo man was created by God, known as Mwene Nyaga in pure original Kikuyu language, also as Ngai in current Kikuyu language. God would then command Gikoyo to establish his home at Mukurwe wa Nyagadanga. This can be compared to the Garden of Eden for the Kikuyu. Kai opa Gikuyu amwitire mudu. Na hedi asokire kona mudu. Atorete atare mukenu, ni amubire mumuteithia. Akimwito mudu. Matora mono gekoya kona muhiki ucio ni muthaka akimra nieri ta kurorogwore yonaga uri muthaka uthaka waku ni unyubaga ndigwitaga mubi akimwita ritwa riu ni wega ni wega ai ni goto hingorera murango akioma the kikuyu dairy process is interesting not just in the steps involved, but also in that there are two criteria involved in determining how the dairy negotiation is to be commenced between the father of the boy and the father of the girl. <laughs> hey. The visitors then offer the father of the girl the traditional beer, Njohiya Jorio to ask for the girl's hand in marriage. To drink the beer, the father asks permission from the girl. This point is critical, because if the girl does not consent, the negotiation is cancelled, meaning the intended marriage is off. If the girl gives consent, it is symbolic that she is willing to be married to the party, for in Kikuyu customs, the girl chooses her partner willingly. Hey! 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 Hey!